Hello friends, this video on carbon and its compounds part 7 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Before watching this video, please make sure that you have watched part 1 to part 6. Now we'll take some questions. The question is what will be the electron dot structure of carbon dioxide CO2? Same thing here, we'll have this carbon and oxygen. Carbon, atomic number 6, oxygen, atomic number 8. So carbon is nothing but 2,4, electronic conjunction oxygen is 2,6 and the noble gas is 2,8. So this guy needs 4, that means carbon needs 4 and oxygen need 2 because it has 6, it needs 2 to become 8. So this is what I know. It will form CO2, it will let's let, write like this. Carbon has 4, let's write 4 like this. Oxygen has uh, 6, let's write 6 like this. Here also 6 like this. Right? It needs 4, so it will, carbon needs 4, it will take 2, two from this oxygen, 2 from this oxygen. Correct? And now carbon, uh, carbon will feel that it has got 8 electrons for its personal and 2 to borrow from each electrons. Oxygen will also feel that it has got 8 electrons. 6 personal, 2 from this carbon and this guy will also feel like the 8 electrons and then they will feel happy. Correct? And that is nothing but my electron dot structure of this CO2. What would be the electron dot structure of sulfur which is made of 8 atoms of sulfur? Please note this. This guy is a little uh, that tricky part. But sulfur if you see it has 6 electrons in valence cell. That means it will need, it needs 2. Right? It needs 2. And it says that it is made of 8 sulfur atoms. So 8 sulfur atoms just like this. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Let's make something like this. 7, 8. Right? Now each of these will have 6. So let me draw 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. This guy will also have 6. So let me draw 6 here. 1, like this I'll draw with this star. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. This guy will also have 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Sorry. All with dot I'll draw this one. Correct. This guy let me draw with stars. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Let's see this guy let me draw with dots. Right? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. This guy let me draw with stars. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. This guy let me draw with the dot again. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Or if we draw this guy something different because this dot dot is matching, right? So, there are only 7 actually. There should be 8, I think. So, let me draw one more here actually. Sulfur. Let me draw something here. Let me draw here only. So, let me draw this guy with a square. Square shape. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6. Right? I got 6 here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 8. And each got 6. Let me draw this guy with something different. So let me draw with guy with a cross like this. Okay? Now if you see, this guy should get 2. So it will take 1 from here and 1 from here. This guy also needs 2, it can take 1 from here, 1 from here. This guy needs 2, it can take 1 from here, 1 from here. This guy needs 2, it took 1 from here, it will take another from here. This guy also needs 2, right? 1 from here and 1 from here. Similarly, if you see it has formed this kind of structure or W structure, right? Generally, the sulfur formed this kind of structure called W structure where you see all these are satisfied now. This guy got 8, 6 it had 
one and one it got from these two like this sulfurs. To take this sulfur, this had six, one it got from this sulfur, one it got from this sulfur. This is eight now. This guy had six, it took one from this sulfur, one from this sulfur. Right? This one straight line only. By mistake, I made so thick line. This guy also had six, it took one from this guy, one from this guy, it has eight now. Similarly, if you talk about this guy, it had six, it took one and one share. So that's how it is. It's W shape thing. And everything is satisfied now with the electron dot structure of a sulfur that's made of eight molecules. Correct. Right. Some people ask, why did you make W shape? Why you didn't make a circular shape? I can make like this also. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, right? And if you add, if you combine these like this, it will also form well, the same structure, right? Because each molecule here you see is shared. This guy will also work, but this is by observation. So when the chemists observe the sulfur molecule, they found that this is a W shape. This is a W shape, right? And that's why we make like that. We don't make like this. So this is by observation. We were told by chemists that the sulfur makes W shape kind of structure and that's why we have made this W shape structure. Thank you. Visit examfear.com to watch free educational videos, try free online tests, get the best quality study materials, study from the best tutors and mentors and much more. Thanks once again.